Part two of this walkthrough, we're gonna view the cutscene, so I will be quiet so you can view this awesome cutscene. In this stage, we are doing something called a tactical restart, where you restart so you can rearrange your inventory, get rid of your whatnots, it'll come in handy. And reload if you need to. I don't even know why I did that, but uh... See. <laughs> One bag bullet. Let's make this count. And off we go. For this part, it's not mandatory that you use the rocket launcher they set in the stage, but it actually kind of helps from expending your ammo. If you truly want to be a good sport, you would use the good old Smith & Wesson 29 Magnum like I would. The trick here is to lose Wesker, or at least make him lose track of you, so... Isolate him, and then whenever he does this, and he staggers back like this, run up, square, square, circle, X, X square simultaneously. <clears throat> Just repeat this step over and over and over again, and you are ensured to beat Wesker really quick. 
You can use the rocket launcher on him because it saves ammo, but I prefer being a sport and not using the rocket launcher unless I'm actually running out of ammo. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> Yeah, I shot with a pistol. <laughs> <clears throat> Trick to this map is to keep your rate on at all times so you can see Wesker. It's that blue little dot or blue triangle. Experienced players can beat Wesker if they want to with just a combination of handgun and melee, but I suggest newcomers do not attempt this until they actually figure out how to beat Wesker up and figure out his pattern. Okay, uh... It's about time I actually use that rocket launcher because I only have one round in my in the mag left and I, I need to put him down so I can at least use the melee. Oh shit! Do not get hit by these missiles. I was not expecting that. Just a little more running around, people. Just bear with it. Point blank, Wesker! I shall let you watch this cutscene, and as soon as it's over, I will switch or turn the camera off and on so we can see the next part of the walkthrough. Did it work?